We should think about the questions themselves and where they're emanating from and perhaps the questions themselves are flawed. And I want to give you just one simple example that the right always uses, Islamophobes always use uh, and they make a very big deal of it. And that is they say for example, oh, uh, your, your prophet astaghfirullah was, and they use a very vulgar word, uh, interested in young people, and I don't want to use the word out of respect for the Prophet because the age of Aisha was uh, young age. It was nine years old in the Sahih Bukhari hadith. Okay, she was nine years old according to Hadith of Bukhari. And so they use a very vulgar word. And I've had young men and women come to me, Muslims, and they say, how can we accept this? This is something that is vulgar. It's unethical. I can't believe that a prophet would do this. Now, this person, and this is a classic example. This question is emanating from a particular mind, coming from a particular culture of a particular generation and a particular time and a particular place. The worst enemies of the Prophet ﷺ, who smeared him with everything imaginable. They couldn't even think of this as a flaw. Why? Because cultures vary, practices vary. And it's not just Islamic or Arab culture. The reality is, 500, 1000 years ago, the world over, people were marrying at younger ages. Why? Because the lifespan was shorter and young kids became mature faster. A nine-year-old of uh, uh, 1400 years ago is like a 16, 17 year old intellectually and biologically of our times. So when we say nine, we are back projecting our nine-year-old of uh, 2014, you know, Detroit, imagining a nine-year-old girl and then back projecting that into Medina and saying, oh, how could our process and marry somebody that's nine? See, this is a cultural bias. Go do the research. In some states to this day, I'm from one of them, Tennessee, you can marry people at the age of 14 or 15. Right? It's not magical, the age of 18. 50 years ago, 100 years ago, the average age of getting married was in your teen. Uh, 500 even more so, Romeo and Juliet. When Romeo and Juliet was written, do you know the age of Romeo and Juliet in the Shakespeare's play? Romeo and Juliet are supposed to be 14 and 13 years old. <laughs> Allah